Philippine President Ferdinand Marcos Jr. said on June 23 his country is not in the business of instigating wars and will always aim to settle disputes peacefully amid escalating maritime confrontations with China. In defending the nation, we stay true to our Filipino nature that we would like to settle all these issues peacefully, Marcos said in a speech to troops of the Western Command Unit in charge of overseeing the South China Sea. Philippine Navy personnel and the Chinese Coast Guard had their latest clash last week in the disputed waterway, where the Philippine military said a Filipino sailor was severely injured and its vessels damaged. In the performance of our duties, we will not resort to the use of force or intimidation or deliberately inflict injury or harm to anyone, Marcos said. He did not name China in his speech. Beijing's actions during a routine Philippine resupply mission have been condemned by the United States, UK and Canada. China's foreign ministry disputed the Philippine account. With a spokesperson saying on June 20 that the necessary measures taken were lawful, professional and beyond reproach. China claims almost the entire South China Sea, a conduit for more than 3 trillion US dollars for Singapore dollars. 1 trillion of annual shipborne commerce, including areas claimed by the Philippines, Vietnam, Indonesia, Malaysia and Brunei. In 2016, the Permanent Court of Arbitration in The Hague said China's claims had no legal basis. A decision Beijing has rejected.